Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to Faith Budgets. On this channel, I'll be posting videos about how we use the zero-based budget, sinking funds, cash stuffing, and savings challenges to pay off debt and save at the same time. If that's content that you're interested in, then please keep watching and definitely hit the subscribe button and join us on this journey to financial freedom. So in today's video, I will be filming um, cash stuffing for the third week in August. I started to say October. <laughs> Not October yet. Everybody wants to skip to October. Fall's a, a great time of year. Summer's o almost over, so everybody's ready to jump to fall now and all the fall activities that come with it. Uh, if you're new to the channel, welcome. My name's Holly. Um, I'm a zero-based budgeter. Uh, semi cash budgeter uh, most of the our accounts our bills and variable expenses are with cash but i do have some things that i still leave in our checking account and that may be auto drafted but for the majority of our spending we do use cash and then uh, put that money back in the bank to make those payments so that's why we do cash stuffing into our uh, variable spending for wall in my wallet I have envelopes and also in the binders here I have sinking funds and savings challenges that I contribute to to help save money for those uh, upcoming events and also to pay off debt we have one debt left that we're focusing on and hopefully um, we swapping that out maybe get that paid off and um, I'm looking at a newer SUV so we may end up paying off the Honda side-by-side -side and then borrowing the money to get to go towards the newer SUV after I sell my older one so changes to come with that soon hopefully <laughs> um, so let's just get started I just got my cash out here um, let's see what all do I have here this is the teller slip that we had that we took to the bank my husband went and got the money out uh, we with he withdrew $1,650 he took his 150 that he keeps in his wallet, so that ended, that leaves us with 1500 is what we should have here to budget to work with today for our stuff into our binders. And then I have my binder here that I'll pull out my cash planning sheet to go by. But I guess let's just give this money account first to make sure we have 1500. I'll need the good handy dandy calculator there. Let's do the, this this way first. Do 100s. One, two, three, four, five, six, and one hundreds. Twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, one, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, two, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty-three, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty-four, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty-five, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty-six, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty. So six eighty. Whoops. I just knocked that off. That was six hundred and ones. And then six eighty and twenties. Okay, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 140, and 10s. So having 5s, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-
I hope everybody's having a great weekend, a great payday, great payday routine. Uh, I just look forward to payday. I, I can't wait till, till we get our check and I get to figure out what we're going to do with our, our sinking funds. And I don't know, I'm just a nerd like that, I guess. <laughs> I look forward to it every week. Um, let's just get started with the, let's pull out the cash planning sheet. This is my plan, budget planner for Missy Money. This is what I use to make a plan for my my money each week when we get paid. I start out doing it monthly and then I break it down into weekly when we get paid. So we're working with the third paycheck in August. So we'll go to the number three tab. And this is the paycheck breakdown and cash planning sheets. You can check out my other video just right before this. This was the um, budget with me for August pay week number three. And I go over all this and get all this calculated and pick my denominations and all that good stuff. So we'll just put this over here to the side. I'll start with my wallet. Then we'll go to our binders or sinking funds and stuff those. And then I also have some money out for some savings challenges. And I'll do a couple of these. The mini Mondays we'll do on Monday. And I didn't get to do last Mondays because I was out of town. We were on vacation in Orange Beach, Alabama. So <clears throat> I skipped that mini Monday. So I still have my 41s in there from last week. So I will add this, so this will be like an 80, it'll be double, a double mini Monday. So that'll be fun. I'll have 80 ones to work with and do, play those uh, mini Monday savings challenges. So that will be super fun. I can't wait to do that. All right, let's just get started. I'll stick this over here to the side so that I can use that for my cheat sheet and that will be for my wallet. So let's get started with the wallet first. <coughs> this wallet is from Missy Money. There's her logo there. It has the gold zipper, gold hardware. Envelopes fit perfect in here. Plenty of card slots. And what I love about it is the zipper is inside here. <clears throat> it's in this little pocket here. And the extra large pocket there. You can put your phone in there if you want to. And also a pocket here and a pocket here. So Love, love, love this wallet. It's the perfect size. It's in between the size of the Budget Mom's Big Planner wallet. And then <clears throat> I think it was some of the other Zippy wallets, maybe a, the Aesthetic Dollar. It was smaller and it didn't have the zipper, larger zipper pocket for the change. And then there was some more, I think one I had purchased on Amazon. It was smaller and it didn't hold the big uh, envelopes like that. It, the zipper kept getting caught in my in my envelope. So um, let's get started. I took all my receipts out already because I did have to clean my wallet out from vacation and I scanned all those receipts into uh, Fetch Rewards app and also Receipt Hog. You can check out the referral link below if you wanna join in on saving some receipts and turn that into points to redeem for cash back and gift cards. It's pretty easy to do and you can scan the receipt into both apps. The, I just usually start with Fetch, scan them in there, make me a little pile and then I start over and I scan them all again in the, in the Receipt Hog works out pretty good and then I just trash them so <clears throat> like I said the, my referral links in the in below if you want to click on and hop on and join us but I think if you scan after you scan your first receipt you get some bonus points and then so do I so win win for all of us so first up we have groceries now I did not spend I didn't do a Walmart pickup because I was out of town so I did roll over I did keep some in here because I will have to get some things that I, I was not here to get uh, last week. So my grocery bill will probably be a little bit higher. So I didn't want to completely drain it and take it out and put it towards savings. Yet, I'll see what all I do with my grocery pickup this week. But so far, I'm going to leave, I think I'm going to leave uh, 160 in there. I normally budget 260. So we'll add another 260 to the 160, yeah. So I did a hundred and then eight twenties. Is that right? Yeah. It'd be a hundred and then 160. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60. So let's see what our total is now for groceries. And this is not just food. This is household items. This is anything at Walmart. Um, could be shampoo, toothpaste, deodorant, um, toilet bowl cleaner, um, bleach spray that I clean with or any kind of uh, 
household items, personal hygiene, anything like that. So it's not just food here. 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 420. Yep. 420. And like I said, I'm, I probably won't use all of that, but I am out of several things. Uh, I'm out of mousse that I use for my hair. Um, uh, mascara, I think. Just a couple of little things that I usually do include in my Walmart order. Uh, I have a self-care envelope, but I use that for my higher purchase items like my sun, uh, facial products, uh, skincare products, and um, my hair hair care products that are a little bit more expensive, things that I wouldn't buy at Walmart. So, hope that makes sense. <laughs> and then gas, um, I'm going to leave 17 in there, and then we'll get 200, and I'm just doing 20s in that. I'm going to roll that over. I have a doctor's appointment, so I will be traveling out of town so i thought well, i'll just leave that 17 in there it's not much but i'm gonna leave it 20 40 60 81 20 40 60 82 so that should be 217 that's 200 10 15 16 17 okay 217 in gas hopefully when i get a newer suv it should make the gas go down Ooh, we have some gas guzzlers eating out um, uh, okay, I was going to keep some out of this, I believe. I was going to put 40 into savings, but I want to do 10, 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. I'm going to put that over here to play for some savings challenges. So I will leave 20 in there, and then this week I will contribute 60. To that so that should be 80 for eating out I thought I would roll over a 20 in case we do go somewhere to eat like maybe whenever I go to the doctor or something so that would help with that and then donations I, I'm leaving that in there there's 15 in there still and I'm gonna put a regular 45 20 30 45 so our total now will be, I'll get it in a minute. <laughs> oh, what am I doing? What in the world am I doing? Here we go. You guys, it's almost 10 o'clock at night and I go to bed. I try to get in bed by 9.30 or 10 because I, I start work at 5.30 in the mornings. I work from home, so I'm trying to get back into the sleep getting in bed earlier we were on vacation so i got my sleep all messed up and so now i'm up but i'm still sleepy <laughs> i don't know i gotta get back on track 20 30 40 50 55 60 in donations i can pick my hours i work whatever you know kind of as long as i get my hours in but i do like to get up and get started and get get my day finished my work day <clears throat> shopping we'll get 40 it's two 20s let me see, I don't think, was I going to roll any over? No, I was going to leave that all there. I had 40 in there. I didn't spend any last week. So, that should be 80. 20, 40, 60, 80 for shopping. I do have a couple of things I want to get on Amazon. It's time to get the 2025 calendar. I usually keep a calendar here at my desk, hanging on my pegboard or cork board or whatever you call it beside my desk. And I've got to get that ordered couple other things I had in my Amazon cart that I want to get just for me and then health and medical is my prescriptions prescription medications I'm leaving that in there there's 40 now oh and I'm gonna add 15 20 40 55 in health and medical which is medications and anything like over-the-counter meds that we may need to pick up while we're at Walgreens Miscellaneous, we'll get 40, but I am going to roll some over into savings, 40. Is that right? Okay, yes. I'm going to put this over into savings, but I'm, then now this week is the new. I'm going to add 40 more to it. I didn't have to use that because we were on vacation, so I will contribute that to our savings challenges. And this will be the 40 for next week get my wallet ready it's a good feeling when I have my wallet ready to go it's all clean the receipts are where they need to be 
Okay, kids activities. He's gonna get another 10. So 10, 20, 30 there. I'm gonna leave that in there. We'll continue rolling that over so that we build that up just a little bit to have when we go start going to sports activities for the kids. And then my spent envelope, I am working on that right now because I'm still adding a little bit to it from vacation where I use my credit card. So I have all that over here. It's too big to fit in here. <laughs> and then my husband purchased some things too. So he gave me some of his cash back. So I'm working on that now. So it's a, it's a hot mess over there to the side, but I will get that ready for him to make a deposit tomorrow into the bank. Okay, so that's all for the wallet. Now we'll flip the page and go over to the binders and envelopes. First up is the green binder. And this will be emergency and it's gonna get five. So let's see what we have here. I do have some in the bank. I have 600 in the bank. Oops. This is my little placeholders. So this means that this money here is in the Ally High Yield Savings Account labeled emergency in that bucket have several different buckets for all of these envelopes. <clears throat> so this one is labeled emergency and there's 600 in there and then 20, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70. Now we have 670 total. And when that when that $70 reaches 100, I can move that over into the Ally. I usually like to wait till it gets to an even 100 or maybe even 200 before I roll it over. But I like to get that in there to let that, you know, accrue the interest. Okay, emergency, pet, um, insurance premiums, nothing this time, pet care. Yes, getting 20. And I'll just get a $20 bill. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60. Awesome, 160. That's good for the dogs. And that bill that's probably getting about time for dog food. That takes a pretty big hit because we usually get two big bags at once. Transportation, so we're just giving self-care this time and memberships. Transportations, transportation, which is car care. I mean, not car care, <laughs> car tags. And it's gonna get 30, a 20 and a 10. Ooh. Here we have 100 in the bank. Twenty, forty, sixty. 70, 80, 90, 200, 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55. 255? Yes. Awesome. I think we have tags due in September for the for my Yukon. And then also we have a Honda side by side and it is road ready. You know, it's it's insured and tagged and all that. So we the tags will be due on that too. Then we have rent, which is lease land, and this one is getting so close to being done. Let's see. It's We just have to get to 500 on this. Uh, my husband and his dad lease some hunting land here in Tennessee. 30, it's gonna get a 20 and a 10. So let's see how close we are. So one, two, three, ooh, 400 in the bank. 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 495. So I only need five more dollars to go in here and it will be fully funded. And we pay that on Halloween. That's how we remember, just to pay it on Halloween. So five more dollars and that will be done. And we can just move that over into the, that other 100 into the high yield savings account labeled lease land and let that sit there until time to pay it. And then we'll take it out. Awesome, that'll feel good to have one complete. And then here is UT tickets, events, University of Tennessee foot, college football. We have two season tickets. We, we purchase those each year. My son goes to college there, so we do like to go to most of the home games. And we are gonna contribute 70 this time. 20, 40, 60, and 70. So let's see what we have here. In the bank, we have 500, 600, 700, 800, 20, 40, 60, 80, 900, 10, 20, 30, 35, 40. 
set. I don't know, 40? Yeah. Awesome. Can't wait. 16 more days until football time in Tennessee. We cannot wait. We are ready to do some tailgating. Um, we are going to, I think, the Kent State game, which is September the 14th, I believe, is the first game we're going to. We're not going to be able to go to the first game on August 31st. My niece's birthday. She's sweet 16. And I think my husband has to work. So <laughs> that one didn't work out. But we will be going to the Kent State game, Florida game, Alabama game, Kentucky game, possibly Mississippi State game. I think, yeah. So, and I don't know about the other ones yet. When it gets into hunting season, we don't go as much. And it gets a little colder. But um, definitely like to go to the ones in October. Especially the 3rd October and Saturday. 3rd uh, October. 3rd Saturday in October. I'll spit it out in a minute. That's usually our Alabama game. Okay, then we have property tax. Which will be $10. Okay, see what we have here. 100 in the bank, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, I mean, 200, 5, 10. So 210, 210. yes, 210 in property taxes. This is for the land. We own about 10 acres across the road in addition to our home in nine acres. But we have it already paid for. So we have to pay the taxes for that. Next up is the white binder. It just has Sam's and a couple of maintenance. Sam's is going to get 35, 20, 35. So, what is our total now? I'm so sleepy. Uh, this may be a hot mess, y'all. Sorry. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 10, 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39. Yeah, 139. Luckily, I have those trackers. They help keep me on track. I do have to make a Sam's order. I need toilet paper, paper plates. Something else I had on there. Oh, laundry detergent couple of things I usually get there. Gifts we're going to skip this time. Car maintenance is going to get 120. I'm trying to bulk that one up a little. I did, we did do 100 and a 20 for that. 120, 40, 60, 80, 220, 30. 230 and car maintenance. Uh, with older vehicles, definitely going to have a car maintenance. <laughs> But bumped up just a little bit. Home maintenance is 110, 110. Just recently started bumping this up up a little for those. We have a newer home. We built our home in 2019. Moved in. Yeah, we moved in in 2019. But you know, things still come up. You still have to maintain your home. Not necessarily purchase new things, but you have to keep it running, keep it up to date, keep it, your filters clean and renewed and all that. So I want to make sure that we have stuff for car, for home maintenance as well. 120, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 300, 10, 11, 12, 312. Yes, 312. For home maintenance. We still have to get our ceiling fixed. We cannot get the guy to come and, that does the drywall. <laughs> people just will not come. I don't know what's wrong with people. They say they'll come and then they don't. When you call them again, they say, oh, oh yeah, I'm, I'm meant to come. I'm, I'll come this next Saturday. And then they don't show up. <laughs> so I don't know. We're just going to look for some other, I think we're going to look for another person to come and patch the, we had a, a leak upstairs in the bathroom. So we cut a little small hole in the ceiling, repaired that leak. It was something to do with the pipe, drain pipe or something. And then, so now there's a small hole there. So we have to get that patched up and then stomped. The ceiling has to be stomped with that drywall mud. 
So if not, if it weren't work for that, we could probably try to do it ourselves, but I don't know how to make it look like the rest of the ceiling. <laughs> anyway, okay, I think that's all in this one. College, wedding, uh, I will be, I have $220 in here is all I have so far. I've really got to be adding a little bit to this. My son proposed to his girlfriend, so now they are engaged. They got engaged on the way back from our beach vacation. They stopped on the way back. <clears throat> they drove back to Knoxville and by themselves, and they stopped by the river on, at sunset and on a pedestrian bridge, and he proposed to her there. So it was so romantic and so excited for them. I'm over the moon excited for to be gaining a daughter. I cannot wait. So excited for them. Cell phone and furniture and decor is not getting anything. Okay. So that is all for that binder, the white one. Let's go to the blue one. <clears throat> Entertainment. This will be for travel to the games. Any other weekend travels or, or going out with my girlfriends if we go eat <clears throat> or go shopping or just anything like that. Or if I go with my sisters and do something. <clears throat> Or maybe this date night could even be in this category too, if I want it to be. And it's gonna get 200. I'm gonna put two $100 bills in here. This will probably be go towards our room to stay a couple nights whenever we go to the ball games up in Knoxville. I did get one weekend paid for by using the points that I accrue on the credit cards, from using credit cards to pay our bills and do our spending and then I use the cash and pay that off. I have received enough reward points to have two nights stay in Knoxville. So I was so excited. I think I had to pay like $22 or something. So it was, I was so excited. I, it paid off. So it really made me more motivated to do the whole credit card point system. It, it's worth it to me if I, you know, get a couple nights stay free you know, during the football season. That makes it worth it for me, so. And it keeps me on track, paying our bills and paying, keeping everything paid up. Okay, so now in total in entertainment fund, travel is one, two, three, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 85, 20, 40, 50, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59. Yep, 559. And that built up because we're staying two weekends in a row in October for those two games for sure. So I already have those rooms booked. And then vacation is not getting anything. I had $25 left from our vacation. So I did not overspend. I did not go over budget. I had $25 left. So I just left that in there. I don't know when our next vacation is, but I just, I didn't want to see an empty envelope. So <laughs> I was proud of myself. Next new car is going to get skipped because I'm using our Mini Monday savings challenge for that. And then possibly some of my other savings challenges when I complete those, that will go into this envelope, hopefully. Then we have Christmas is going to get $150. Ooh. $120. Oops. Ooh. 30 35, 40, 45, 50. I'm not sure why I did that. Oh, I, I messed up with the, my denominations. Yeah, I have more fives in there than what I meant. That's okay, though. I can always make some change later. I could just do the two fives over here and use that 10. That'll be fine. All right, let's see what we have here. I'll get it in a minute. I got all kinds of stuff going on here. Twenties. We have tens. I'm making a big old mess. <laughs> get it together, Holly. Get it together. Okay. So in the bank, we have one, two, three, four, five hundred in the bank. Oh, I need to change that out. 
I do have a 500 placeholder. Let's change that out. It'll save some room in the, in the envelope. Yeah, there we go. Let's change that out. One, two, three, four, five. Why have I not already done that? So 500 in the bank. I hear my chair squeaking. 6, 7, 20, 40, 60, 88, 20, 40, 60, 89, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95. Oh, 995? Yeah, almost a thousand. Saved up for Christmas. I, said, I, did, I was watching a YouTube video just today, I think. And I did see a YouTuber, but Cash Budgeter, she has a Christmas binder with individual envelopes for each person that she buys for. I thought that was so neat. And she, I guess she has a budget set for each one. And then I guess starts at the beginning and, you know, fills that up and you have the money for each person that you're buying for. And that would make it easy to, you know, when you're going shopping, or you order something online, okay, I'm going to buy for my niece here at this one and grab it out of her envelope. And then my uh, my son out of this one or my husband out of this one, you know, and it, it would just make it easier to stay on track and not go over budget because I love spending on Christmas gifts and I always go over. That would be a good way not to. That's a very good idea. I don't know, but it would just, it might be a lot of envelopes. Or I guess I could lump some together, like maybe, I don't know, the bigger ones at least put those, you know, like my kids and my husband, put those separate. That's the main ones that I usually go over on. Or maybe I should do my nieces too. I don't know, but that is such a cute idea. I thought that was so neat. That's something to think about. <clears throat> and I definitely need to be adding to holidays. I wrote a note for the next paycheck to be adding some in there because... I do want to have some money for fall activities. We do pumpkin carving and painting and have a couple get-togethers at my house during that time of year, just usually in October. And then I usually do Thanksgiving at my house too. So I want to have a little extra money in there for that. So I do need to add a little bit to holidays. So I have a Christmas binder, a Christmas envelope just for Christmas. And then holidays would be for all other holidays, which is mainly the fall, October, Halloween, Thanksgiving. Really don't do anything much that would require a lot of money as far as like for 4th of July or Memorial Day, Labor Day. Oh, Mother's, Mother's Day and Father's Day. Those would fall in there. Ooh. Yes, need to be adding back to that. To that. Special occasion is anniversary, nothing. Medical debt, I put 100 in there because I want, my husband has to have some dental work done. So we want to make sure we have that in there. So, yes, that is all for this blue binder. Now, let's do some savings challenges. Uh, let's put the 40 in here for Mini Mondays, and then we'll get that out of the way. So, this is the 40 ones that I'll put in here to do the Mini Mondays. Ta-da! See, I already have 40 in there. I hadn't done it yet. So, now I will have 80. We get to play double. I don't even know if this thing will close. <laughs> So my mini Monday's video may be a little longer than usual, but that'll be okay. That will be next. So let's do the 52 week challenge first. Let's always do it first and see if we can see which week we're on. Okay. And I don't know what to do with my blue marker. I never come prepared, sorry. Okay. Week number four is what we're on. So, one, two, three, four.
So 52 weeks. Week number four. Pretty simple. Can't wait to get this thing filled up. Next week we'll start with week five. And this saves over a thousand dollars, a little over a thousand dollars. So I'm excited to see see this envelope grow. So okay, that completes the 52 week challenge. Try to just put it in there, forget about it. Now let's do the 12 month savings challenge. And I did not start on this until July. July is complete. Now we have August and we have 10 to put in here. So let's color in our 10. 10 little sunshines. So we are moving right along for August. I just made them $1 for each sun, so a total of $50 will be saved for August. There we go. So that is the 12 month savings challenge from Missy Money. That one's done. Now let's move right along to the One month ahead savings challenge. Now, well, let's see how much money we had to work for this one. Mm -hmm. I've never been a month ahead. 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 76. Okay. 76. I have an odd number there. That's six. So. I may have to do the six there to give me, yeah, let's do that. Two, four, six. Let's do these three here with the six dollars. Okay, that one's kind of hard to stay in the lines. Let's put the six dollars in here for this one. This is for health and medical. You just pick what you want to make each challenge total. So this one was two dollars for each icon here to equal a hundred dollars for my health and medical. That would basically cover my medications for a month. So that would be great. And I think I'd I listed mine, mm, no, I didn't do it in any specific order. I started to say I did it largest to smallest. No, no specific order. But this is definitely the largest that I have, mortgage. So let's see what we got. 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, perfect. So I can do two of these, 20, perfect. That sounds good to me. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's color this in. We're gonna do two of these to equal 70. All right, that's 70 
more dollars to the mortgage. I need to ask, how do you guys, when you're, when you're a month ahead, how do you do that? Like, I've never been a month ahead, so I don't know exactly how that works as far as when I fill this binder, then what do I do with that money? Do I just leave that sitting in my checking account? And then my bills are on auto pay? Hmm. I think that's how it works. And then for the next months, while I'm working on each paycheck, oh, that's when you put the 25% in there per paycheck. And your money's really already in there, sitting in there waiting for your bills to be paid. Okay, it's, it's coming to me, it's coming to me. <laughs> So I've just never been a month ahead. I mean, I've had extra in there, but not enough for to complete a whole month's, you know, bills and expenses. Okay, so that's month ahead binder. Getting the mortgage off to a good start. Looking pretty good so far. All right, you guys, that is all for the savings challenges. So that has it all complete for our cash stuffing. This seems like it was a long video because I'm adding a few of the savings challenges in there with it. So makes it a little bit longer but i will do our mini monday savings challenge on monday i'll post that for monday i'll have the two weeks in one so it'll be a little bit longer i get to roll the dice a few more times maybe get to complete out some challenges and bring up some new ones and all the ones that i have so far have been freebies so come check that out if you want to see a mini mini monday savings challenge and i will see you guys on the next one i hope you guys have a wonderful weekend and um have a good payday, have a good budget, and I will see you guys on the next one. Thanks.